Hey guys, how the f*** are you? My name's Clayton Fioriti, and we're going to talk about a game today. The Lost World Jurassic Park for the Sega Genesis. Now, I played through this a little bit earlier today, and uh, it's a great game, man. I highly recommend anybody playing this, especially if you're a Jurassic Park fan. Not just because it's the Lost World and it's fucking cool, but look at these graphics. Now, this game was in 1997, and it kind of got overshadowed by its big brother on the PlayStation and uh, Sega Saturn, if you even know what the hell that is. Uh, this game, though, looked great for these boss battles. This is with no add-ons, no Sega CD, no 32X, nothing, just a straight-up cartridge. You're dodging trees in the Redwood Forest, shooting at hunters that are, like, shooting Uzis at this Velociraptor. After you're done with that, you shoot your own Trank darts at the Raptor, trying to knock it out. I don't know where they got the idea for this particular boss battle. I'm assuming from the Sarah Harding scene from the Lost World novel, which was turned into a piece of the movies through Jurassic World with Chris Pratt. But I will say, this is fucking awesome. Now, the majority of this game is like a top-down perspective with, uh, you know, typical Sega Genesis graphics, but it does have pre-rendered CG dinosaurs, kind of like Donkey Kong Country. And parts like these, where the actual boss battles happen, really shine. We've got scrolling, we've got trees coming from the background into the foreground. You're passing them, you have to dodge them. I mean, a lot of this is sprite-based, but... It looks really good. I mean, again, a Sega Genesis game. There's no add-ons with this, and in the later boss stages, it actually does get to near PlayStation level. Uh, I love this game. If you want to pick it up, do so now, because it'll probably jump in price pretty soon. I got this thing complete in box for 20 bucks, and you better do the same before it rises any further. Uh, this game is pretty fucking good, though, man. I totally recommend it. If you're a fan of Jurassic Park, check it out. And if you're a fan of the Sega Genesis, you really don't have anything to miss. I mean, this is one of the best-looking Genesis games I've ever seen, and nobody wants to talk about it. I have no idea why. It's fun. It's Jurassic Park, so it totally fits the time in which it came out. But other than that, it's just not well-known. Uh, it's a rare gem, in my opinion. And if you're interested, give it a look. Thanks for taking the time to watch the video, guys. As always, take it easy. Yeah.